There. There we go. There's nothing more friggin' annoying is when you want to go to the bathroom, do your business, and there's no toilet paper there. Because you really don't check, right? So whoever's in there last is responsible for filling that part, okay? Including me. Sometimes I mess up, but I'm not going to admit it. Good morning, beautiful people. What's happening? It's 6 o'clock in the morning. I'm actually editing yesterday's vlog to get up for today. And then I'm obviously going to start on today's vlog. Um, wife is up. Kids are going to get up any minute now. They're going to head off to school. Once they're out, I'm going to head back downstairs and get to work. All right, fam, what's happening? It's lunchtime now, and I'm going to basically have some soya uh, grind. It's kind of like... Um, like a taco, you know, grind where you make it with beef, but not having the soya because this is like what veggie. You know what? I've forgotten what how many days it's been. I'm vegetarian. I think it's 13 or 14. I honestly can't remember. But uh, I'm gonna show you guys what I'm having here. So that is basically just soy ground right there. I'm just gonna have it with a piece of toast, and then basically eat lunch and then get back to work. Hey guys, what's happening? I'm um, just working away, guys, in my office. Uh, kind of chilly, so that's why I've got my jacket on. Um, cause then I'm, I'm in the basement, but, um, just to touch up on what I was talking about at the end of yesterday's vlog, um, I can't thank you guys enough for, for watching and the really, really cool comments that I got yesterday at a wedding reception and why I'm really excited about it is anyone that starts a business or does something on their own or, you know, has something to do on their own, it's always the hardest to please your peers. And to get that acknowledgement from your friends, cousins, immediate family. Um, yesterday's party I was at, it was all basically family. All my closest friends, who I consider my family, you know, all their, you know, all my friends, cousins, and nephews that, you know, have grown up with us. And to get that solid feedback from, you know, my family, just absolutely amazing for me. It, like, I'm just so stoked, even today, when I was thinking about it. Um, I mean, don't get me wrong guys, I appreciate all the comments that I get, but it just puts stuff into perspective when it's actually, you know, your family supports you, because most of the time, you know, family's the first one to hate, but getting that, um, you know, getting that love from the family is just absolutely huge for me. You know, my goal is to continue to bring, you know, great content and great stuff to talk about, uh, my adventures, my travels, you know, anything that I you know think that's worth vlogging i'm going to try to give you guys and hopefully you guys will like it fam what's happening it's around three o'clock and i'm just basically getting some tea head back downstairs again and then uh get back to work my dad i'm um, gonna pick up the girls today because we still got skating uh again i'm a car down and yeah to be honest i've been lazy i haven't really found anything yet that i'm looking for but um basically dad's gonna come uh, to the house, grab Risa skating stuff, take, uh, go pick up the girls, take Risa to skating, and then she, he's gonna drop Selene off here. And then my wife will go pick the girls up. But uh, I have to work at five o'clock too today. I've gotta jump on another call. But uh, it's gonna be, hopefully not a late night tonight, but it'll be a busy day. But uh, just grab my tea, and then I'm gonna head back downstairs. Hi girls, how are you doing? Good. What'd you guys do today? the letter M. Letter M? And, and if you if you want to do this kind of M, yeah. do that kind of M. If you want to do this M, do that M. So tomorrow you have to take something in with you to school that begins with M. Yeah. What are you going to take? Take your mother. Take mommy. You know what she said? What? She goes, mommy, you're too big. You won't fit. I have to drag you there. <laughs> no, like, no, no. Okay, thanks. I see we saw the birthday decorations up. Well, yeah, let's yeah. just let, let me enjoy them let, for a couple of days. Let her ride it out? Yeah. What right. are you guys having? Roti? Brown dog with roti. Oh, I'm going to have the and same Selena, today. let's move the eye touch. Looks good. All right, guys. 6.15. I just got off work. What a headache. Absolute headache. They just don't leave you alone, man. Well, I guess when you're this big, they call you Mr. Oh. Whatever. Right? But I'm going to have dinner now. Again, veggie flex. This is day... 55? Day 14. <laughs> day 14. So I'm going to have dal with roti, which is basically bread and lentils. You made all my chips. 
I know. How come? Because I like chips. And you even licked the bowl. Well, you, you didn't finish a dog, but you finished Daddy's chips. It's amazing, eh? I finished my red tea. Well, I'm a... Nah. I'm a bat. I'm a bat. I'm a batty. Yeah, what's happening? It's around 7 o'clock. Just doing some errands for the wife. Typical. Basically, go get some groceries. Not much, though. I just got to go get some um, milk for uh, the house. Oh, man. The seat gets adjusted all the time because I sit really low. So, i got to adjust my seat here. But um, I'm just going to adjust the seat and, of course, the steering wheel here because uh, it's in the way. But, as I was saying, got to go to the uh, grocery store, save on foods, typical. Get some milk and uh, I'll probably grab some chips. Shh, don't tell anyone. But um, <clears throat> still a car down, guys. I'm not. Um, I'm not sure what I want to get yet. I kind of haven't decided um, what to get. Uh, do I get a truck? Do I get a car? I was looking around today and trying to figure that out. I do have a couple options, but uh, I want to keep the payment sort of reasonable. It's not that. I can't afford it. It's just, it's just an unnecessary expense. You know what I mean? So, kind of got a couple of things on the works. I gotta sort something out. Hopefully this week because it's getting very difficult. One car. <clears throat> um, I'm glad that my dad's really helped me out. Like for example, in the mornings he'll drop the girls off, pick them up at you know afternoon, drop them off to skating this and that. So really helps. I mean he's gonna have to drop me off the SkyTrain station tomorrow too. So so I can head downtown because it's Tuesdays. But uh, we'll figure it out and um, hopefully I can sort this out this week. Oh, all right guys, let's get some milk. And some chips. And I'll see what other uh, what other junk I can find inside too for today. Awesome, thank you very much. This is really awkward carrying milk bags and stuff. It's pretty heavy, man. But uh, that's done for now. Gonna head home now. And then that's pretty much it. Just gotta chill out today, I think. I'm really tired, honestly. While I was working, I didn't really, you know, I should have mentioned it, but you know, while I was working there, I was, uh, <laughs> I kind of passed out on my uh, desk there. So, yeah, I'm really tired. Hi, peeps. Back home, man. Just uh, gonna unload and stuff. And uh, oh yeah, hey guys, did I tell you about uh, the Mustang, the Beast? I don't think I told you guys, did I? Um, so, anyways, I bought the car off my friend, and um, you know I've done a lot of work to it since then. Um, but I gave my word to my friend that you know if he ever wanted it back or if I was to sell it, um, he would be the first person to or I would contact right now I don't want to sell it but he mentioned to me the other day he goes you know how would you feel if I bought my car back off you and my word means everything okay I gave my word that you know what if you ever want the car back it's yours without question um, he says he wants it we came up with a figure which I do not want to disclose um, now the ball's in his court, but um, you know if he does decide to take it You know I am sad at the same time, but I'm also happy that I kind of reunited You know another car guy with one of his vehicles, so I mean I took care of this baby You know the engines redone, you know just some minor tweaks and stuff that's got to be done, but the car runs mint um, I'm gonna miss it if she goes. I'll keep you posted what happens. Um, he's on vacation right now He's gonna basically decide and uh, yeah, just want to, uh, want to update you, you know, you guys on that. Um, 
But yeah, you know, I'm gonna miss it for sure. Why is it difficult to put toilet paper back in the toilet holder when it's not there when you go in there? There's nothing worse you than going what? in there. But you're the number one culprit of that. You go to the bathroom and the next person is left to deal with an empty roll. That's a lie. That's the truth and you know it's it. It's a lie. So kids, the lesson for today is this. If you're the last person in the bathroom, check the toilet paper because it's your responsibility to refill that spot. Cool thing about school, especially with Selena, is they have to um, take like, they do like a show and tell. It's really cool. Um, the engagement you get with show and tell. Sorry if I'm using these words just being a social media guy, right? But how come adults don't do that? You know what I mean? Like at work, sorry, Tums in my mouth. They should um, do that work, show and tell. Create some conversation, especially with ethnic stuff. You know what I mean? Like I would love to take something like Punjabi or something involved with Sikhi. We do a show and tell and I can explain what it is, what the meaning of it is, what the significance of it is. Imagine the barriers that you would break just by doing like a half an hour thing. I mean, think about it, right? But Selena is going to take her mini and where's Mickey? Mickey's here somewhere. Ah, there he is. So, I'm going to take uh, these two here. Selena's going to take to school for show and tell, guys. Hey fam, what's happening? It's around oh, 9 o'clock. Um, I had a quick 10 minute nap, snooze, I was just so tired. Um, but I'm going to go upstairs because my wife is upstairs. We're going to have some milk, watch some TV, just chill out. Um, good day today, really busy day. Uh, work's been really, really hectic. I'll be doing some late nights um, probably all week just to get some of this project stuff out of the way. Looking forward to the weekend, even though it's Monday. And don't forget, tomorrow's Tuesday, so I should have some action for you guys. But I wanted to say, if you're watching the vlog for the very first time, you know, I honestly greatly appreciate it. Thank you very, very much. You know, please subscribe, be part of the family. And of course, to all my peeps, be you, stay optimistic. Have a great night, and here's a big high five from me to all of you.